Hello everyone, Letterballs here and today we are going to talk about the basic functions of some blocks in Scratch. These are the 7 blocks that we will be talking about in today's episode. In the next episode we will be talking about loops and how they work. The first block is the move 10 steps block. It does what it says. It, it makes a sprite on the screen to move 10 steps. Next is a go to x0, y0. And also one more important thing, you see the white circles inside, you can customize them to your own number. For example, move 89 steps and it moves 89 steps. So go to x0, 0, zero makes it goes to the position in these x0, y0. It goes to this location. The next is turn anti-clockwise 15 degrees. It turns the sprite anti-clockwise the number of degrees. Then it is clockwise 15 degrees. And then the next thing is when clicked, when green flag clicked. This block does a very peculiar function. This, you see this green flag on top. Right now when you press it, it does nothing. But when you connect this to turn anti-clockwise 15 degrees, each time we do it, it turns anti-clockwise 15 degrees. The next block is point in direction 90. This block makes it point in the direction 90. As we all know, this is 0, 90, 180, 270 and 360, which is also known as 0. So 90 means it will be facing this way. The next is wait one second. This block is used to add a delay between code. For example, turn clock is 15 degrees then wait one second no turn anti clock is 15 degrees when I click it nothing happens that is because the code is executed but it is too fast for you to see but when you add a delay in between like this then when we click it turns like this and after one second turns like this as you can see and these are all the blocks that you will need to make your first program. First, we are going to make the cat go in a square movement. First, we need the cat to go to the sentence at every uh, the uh, center at every start of the program. So first, we will put when green flag click, go to x0, y0, and then we need it to move 50 steps and then turn 90 degrees anti-clockwise like this and then it's basically the same like this it's gonna take some time because i have to repeat it four times and as we know square has four sides so that's why and done one two three four yeah okay so oh and also one more thing since it's pointing 90 degrees so we will need it to point in direction 90 why because we need you can see the 90 degrees it's turning so we need to reverse that we need it to point in di direction 90 okay as you can click nothing is happening because we need a delay in between the see it's going it's moving this is a program C it's moving in a square as you can see this is a success if you like this video please remember to subscribe to letterbox and don't forget to hit the bell notification so that you can receive our new video